on board your board. Let's get this over with. <laughs> well, look who's here. New recruits. Well, <laughs> let's fuck some shit up. What? Where am I? I can't move. As yes, Radis looks behind him, barely having the strength to do so, and sees that one, his leg is caught under something. Two, his tail was on top of his leg. So not only is his tail trapped, he is trapped, and he is waiting there for days, up until, you guessed it, a young Izuku by the age of six shows up. Whereas he is beyond weak. Contemplate anyway, is this how I die? Being killed in a fight is one thing, but dying of starvation? Oh, that's just... Oh, that's just bullshit. As soon as he sees Izuku, he's like, Kid, help me! Uh, what? Uh, please help me! Res... I can't believe this. What kind of saying am I, am I asking for help? Izuku's like, but I shouldn't talk to strangers. Uh, please, I don't want to die here. Izuku, hesitant, but trying to help Raz, trying to lift the rocks off of him. It don't work, he's just, just a child. <laughs> Raz... I can you get help? It'll take too long and it looks like you really need to eat something. <sighs> the water you suggest Why why are you unable to move it seems? My tail is trapped. I can't move. Oh in that case is yes, this one is Ziku is on top of Radis and is pulling at his tail. Radis shot is like, wait, what are you doing? I'm sorry, but this is maybe the only way to save you. As Radis is yelling at Izuku, saying, don't you dare fall on my tail. I, I won't be a Saiyan anymore. A what? As it snaps. Radis, now free. And pissed, he destroys the rocks that once pretty much uh, held him hostage. And yeah, he's looking at Izuku like, you bastard. And this is young Izuku, so he's like, you're free, and why are you mad at me? I'm not me anymore. I'm not saying anymore. What's the saying? We're a warrior race <laughs> capable of taking over planets. And now, because my tail's gone, I'm not even. How strong are you? I believe I could destroy a moon. Could? What about now? Our tails are boosters. As well as our weakness, if we're not strong enough. Really? Yes. Oh. Well, sorry. <coughs> so, you're, what you're saying is you're weaker now? Yes. It's bad enough I had to be saved, but even worse, I lost my tail. Maybe death by starvation wasn't such a bad idea anyway. Well, goodbye. Red is pretty much pissed. Good goodbye you after all you did. 
as yes, he wants to kill Izuku right now. He has his hand up, ready to blast Izuku straight to the uh, to like to meet Jesus. But he's he didn't have to save me. He didn't have to help at all. But he still did. I'll let him live for now. As yes, he flies off. And tries to adjust this whole him being weaker than ever, so <laughs> yeah, if you if you thought it weak before, ew. But time goes by, months, let's say, and he finds his way back to Izuku. Him surrounded by Bakugo and his goons. When he sees Izuku defending someone, like, oh, he's trying to play hero again. But seeing the beat up in this, the unfair treatment they're giving Izuku, first he finds, com finds it more funny. Considering that he has the weakling being overtaken by the strong, he is surprised by the quirks. But, well, this is just a natural order of things. In which he has a flashback. With him, Nappa, and Vegeta. Vegeta would definitely bully and demean Radis, calling him a low class Saiyan and this and that, yeah, yeah, yeah. It is a brutality that is not fair. Same for Napok. One, yeah, he is the weakest of them all. Not to mention hell, it is Prince Vegeta. You know saying? I mean, going up against him is pretty much a distance, considering how strong he already is. So yeah, right as he. Oh. I never figured how hard he may, his life may have, <sighs> as yes, as soon as Bongo and his friends leave, Yiku there, he's crying, but he's happy to the point where he's, at least I helped someone. Raz, almost gagging for over the sheer niceness that is Izuku is like, what the hell, man? You got your ass kicked and you're just, you were just worried about the person you helped? God, please don't make me regret this. And yes, Izuku's seeing Raz again. His smirk turns into a frown. He's like, I'm sorry. What, for what? Your tail? Uh, it, it's your. Oh, wait, yes, right. You're saying you don't have a quirk. What's a quirk? Wait, you mean those powers those kids used on you? Yeah. Wait, you were watching? Well, I was passing by and saw at least the aftermath. Oh. Well, how are you. How have you been? Since, uh, <coughs> I'm, I'm fine. I have a question. Do, do you like being picked on? N no. <laughs> do you, would you like to? Be able to protect people better and not get beat up? Yes, yes, please. What if I taught you some, uh, a little bit of martial arts and maybe some key training? Who knows? I. Wait, are you offering to. Train me, just a little, little bit, so you won't be able, 
punching bag anymore. All right? I, I, uh, no, I never. Yes, please. Is it you, him finding the strength to get up and bows or Razley? Please teach me. Uh, I don't believe anyone's ever bowed to me before. As yes, Raz is filled with pride at this moment. As him and the he of the said moment is pretty much like, Very well, meet me at the place where we first met. And our training shall begin. But first, you're going to need some training gear. Hmm? Yes. Do you have a. I need a pen and paper. Him just drawing what. He, he wants the Izuku to have for train gear. And which, to us, it would look very familiar. Huh. This is all I need? Yes. Oh. Um. Uh, okay. Sure. As soon as Izuku shows up, Raz looks at him. He's like... Kakarot. Who? Uh, <clears throat> it's just, um, is it like a, a name? Yes! Yes, yes, it's a name. Uh, really? What, what does it mean? Weakling. Oh. Oh. What, would your brother Robert call you Weakling? I, no, no, I, is, Kakarot's fine. Hmm, good. As yes, this is where Izuku trains with Radis, in which, because of martial arts expect, Izuku is, kids learn faster than adults would, so that's not the most difficult thing for him. So when it comes to key control, where things actually not so sure about. Because seeing what Rass is able to do, though he did say he was weakened, is astonishing to him. He can't help but really wonder how much power he was really capable of. If Rass said he could blow up the moon, Izuku was definitely believing him. Which makes him even more remorseful when it comes to his like, Yeah, I cut off your tail and weakened you to save you. I'm very sorry about that. Yes, he constantly apologizes for weakening Radis. So, Radis is annoyed, definitely, but... Stop apologizing. I already forgave you. Heck, I'm training you right now, aren't I? So, so you, you're you really okay with what I did? Then why are you, why are you so hard on me? Uh, because if I was holding back on you, chances are you wouldn't learn anything. What doesn't kill you makes you stronger. As yes, this is Izuku, pretty much ten years old. He's training with Raz, and when it comes to Inko, she is happy that he has this newly found confidence. He has someone who's teaching him martial arts, and according to him, this thing called Ki. Her looking it up is. There's no way. That takes years. But let's just say Rice is a hell of a lot better teacher than All Might. <laughs> so, once Izuku 
finally start to really get a hang of it, he is 11. He can at least sense it, which Raddus didn't even know was an option. He has his, his scouter. The only thing is, it's broken. He has his armor, which still has a hole in it from that, uh, you say, last attack, special beam cannon. <laughs> And when he sees Izuku charge at him, he gets flashbacks of Gohan and bitch slaps him. Yeah. Yeah, see, Raz was traumatized. <laughs> Anywho. Now, it's time for Izuku's final test when it comes to his key control. He hasn't used any energy blasts. He hasn't flown. If anything... He's only been taught really to feel it, to be more attuned and accustomed to sensing it and whatnot. Like when he finally sensed Raddus, he was like, wait, you can feel my power? He said, yeah. Uh, huh. I feel like I could have been worded differently, but still. <clears throat> So yeah, Izuku actually taught Raz how to sense key. So Raz doesn't even need his scouter. In fact, he gives it to Izuku as a souvenir or whatnot. And Izuku accepts it wholeheartedly. But he does have a smile that kind of gets on Raz's nerves. Like, what's that smile for, motherfucker? <laughs> Heck, you're like a big brother to me. <coughs> yeah, well, yeah, well, well uh, I'm not. Uh, we ain't family. So. Well, we, we don't have to be related to be family. This hits Raddus. He's like, Ugh. what the hell? How are you so nice? You know what? Your final test. Him just grabbing Izuku from his shirt and just tossing him over a cliff. It was like, hey, why did you do that? Fly, damn it, or you die. Or get seriously injured. It is, yes, Izuku is screaming as he plummets. But as he, he's nervous because, like, why did I do that? I don't even know if he's fully ready. Him just pacing back and forth as Izuku continues to scream. And Raz at the end is like, fuck it, I'm saving him. But before he can even take off, he, the screaming stops. No. And yes, he goes flying straight down, looking for anything that... That is either a sign of life or a sign of remains. He sees vultures starting to circle. Him being scared as all hell. Like, oh my god, I killed him. Him just yelling Kakarot over and over again. Until Izuku just hovers above him saying, I did it! Radis, overcome with joy, just hugs him. It's like, I knew you could. Then he instantly just backs off like, hold it, hold it. <laughs> See, you are like my big brother. Uh -huh. Wait. How long have you... Oh, actually... Uh, I was screaming for an extra two minutes before I stopped. I was already flying by then. Wait, what?! Then why did you? I want to get back at you. <laughs> you idiot! I was worried sick about you. I didn't know whether you were gonna. I. <sighs> Whatever. Lessons over for today. Really? Yes, go home. Now you can fly home. 
So that'll save on your commute. Um, but I don't know how to stop. Or at least land. Then take this as a lesson for trying to scare me to death. But I... Go on, go home.